I'll be honest, Leicester's my hometown, so I'm probably a bit biased when I say I love the place. I'm going to be showing you around a few different food spots today from this unassuming city, but don't let that fool you, we've got food from all around the world coming up. Trying to record a video here. <laughs> We're beginning just outside the centre on Queen's Road. With a smattering of tapas bars, it's got a slightly Mediterranean atmosphere. Port and Nata is what we're here for though. Try their take on the classic English breakfast. I'm already on my second coffee of the day, don't judge me. The breakfast comes stacked high, featuring an olive tapenade, a lira sausage and chorizo. Mm, that smoky richness of the sausage. It's really nice. <laughs> it's strange because it feels like home. It feels like the, the classic English breakfast. At the same time, there's, there's something slightly amiss. There's something slightly different about it. It's slightly foreign. Mm. I was wondering if I could get to Pasto Donato to go. And what actually, what actually are they? So they're like tested on. So okay. in Portugal, we make a lot of things with egg. They're very nice. They're the closest you get to the ones in Portugal. And not just because I work here, but because <laughs> yeah, of course. they are a temptation. Oh, yeah. They are one of those <laughs> Every time they come out, you know, Yeah, I bet, I bet. Thank you very much. Thank you so much, guys. Have, have a good day. <laughs> that is a naughty, a naughty little custard tart, really. The texture. It's like soft and flaky. And then when you when you actually bite into it, these rich, subtle flavors of caramel coming through. I think, I think I need a flight to Portugal. Okay, it's not quite a flight to Portugal, but if you go across Victoria Park and through the New Walk, you make it to the center of town where you'll find the market. You can find a variety of fresh fruit, vegetables, and materials here, but there's only one thing I'm here for. I mean, I've never had Latin American food before, so I'm, I'm curious to know what, something that you think is authentic. Right, the main thing, authentic from Latin America, is yeah. the fresh fish. Okay. Yeah. Fresh rice or chips? We're, we'll go for rice, we'll go for fish rice. and rice. Sounds good, yeah. So you want Latin America, you yeah, proper. try the rice. The rice yes, is beautiful proper. with flavor. It's not just white rice. Garlic, mm. the spices from Latin yeah. America, everything, you know what I mean? Mixed together. Yeah, perfect. <laughs> All right. I'm very excited. Hey, wow. The fresh chili from Latin America. Ooh. All the spices from Latin America. Can you try that? Very, very nice, very nice. Thank, Thank you very much. No problem, enjoy. Thank you. Thank you. Now, what do we have here? It's so good, I dropped my fork. <laughs> The rice is zesty and fresh. Some of the best fish I've ever had, I think. This stuff is golden. I could drink a bottle of it, I think, honestly. You know what I mean? It's my own creation from Latin America. All the spices, everything from Latin America. Fresh. Yeah. You know what I mean? The onion in there, it's garlic in there. Yeah. It's, it's lime juice. So, mm, it's so beautiful. I grab all the tomatoes, all the peppers, everything mm. from, the, from the market. And then yeah. Go to the fish market. The fish, the yeah. big one. The, the more big. Yeah. And then fry fresh. Mm. I'm very glad you came to Leicester. Yeah. yeah <laughs> to try this food. I'm very happy you're here. <laughs> Lovely. Every time you're in town center, remember, yes. coming to Latin America, Peru, Machu Picchu, remember Machu Picchu, Thank you, you come to me. Thank nice you. to it's meet you. It's been a pleasure to meet you. There's one more place I want to show you, Maurizio's, bringing a little taste of Italy to the city center. Maurizio himself doesn't speak much, and I like to think he lets the food do the talking. We of course opted for the classic margarita. For a second there, I think I was transported to Italy. I felt the warm glow of the sun. I felt the crickets chirping. With this style of pizza, it's all about the fresh ingredients, the best ingredients you can find, you know. Cheese, you can think of the toppings, but actually, so much of its importance is actually found in the dough. You know, you want something that's very light and airy and digestible. Obviously there's that, but as well, that's only the canvas, and it really takes an artist to make a proper, a proper pizza. Mauricio is very good. I think, that's, I think that's what I've got to say. <laughs> Grazie. Grazie mille.
Thank you very much for watching this video on the channel. I just wanted to say how crazy it was that we got over 30 likes and almost 500 views on our first video on the channel. That was totally unexpected, so thank you very much for the support shown. Of course, the eateries that we show in the videos are always recommendations, so if you are in Leicester, do go check them out. And that's all I've got to say really, so I will leave you with some outtakes from the filming of this video, and I will see you in the next video. Bye. Is that, is that Roy Sabilis? Is that Roy Sabilis? No, it's not, mate. I don't know who you're talking about. <laughs> well, you, you have to sack one of us. <laughs> yeah, if it, I'll, me and Isaac, who you sack? Oh, it has to be me. I've been the most needed. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. <laughs> I'm being serious. <laughs> Lovely. Lovely. <laughs> <laughs>